Texas Air National Guardsmen from the 136 Airlift Wing helped facilitate a food run at Dickey Stadium in Fort Worth, Texas, June 24, 2020. Their mission includes unloading pallets of food, directing vehicle traffic, and loading cars with family food boxes. Tarrant Area Food Bank CEO Julie Butner tells us the goal of giving back to the local community. So this is uh, an emergency box line. Uh, the boxes were packed by the 136 Air National Guard. We're planning on feeding anywhere between 1,000 and 2,000 families today. In an emergency box, we try to give families enough staples to last them a day, two days, three days, depending on what we receive. Uh, we receive the food from the USDA and also from uh, local grocers and manufacturers in the area. And so sometimes, you know, we're at the will of whatever is being donated to us, but we really try to think strategically about the box, what we're putting in it, and trying to make it last for a family of four or for a couple of days. The three varieties of boxes include fresh produce, shelf-stable items, and frozen goods. Tarrant Area Food Bank Agency Services Coordinator Tiffany Trailer and Director of Major Gifts Megan Smock share how all items are designed to give families a variety of food. This is one of our shelf-stable boxes, and so we have a lot of products that would be um, able to be kept on the shelf. The families get typically one box is good for a family of four. If you have a larger family, then you're able to get more. This is a good hearty box of protein for our clients today. It has a five pound bag of chicken and then four frozen meals that they can use throughout the week or the month. It's nice that it's frozen because it'll keep for however long they need it. This is a great distribution because they're getting such a variety of food today. It's not just protein, not just veggies, not just canned food so it'll last them for a long time. Each food run is designed to serve residents in the DFW area who are in need of food assistance or whose access to healthy food has been affected. Guardsmen continue to work with local partners to reduce the impact of COVID-19. Reporting from Fort Worth for the Texas Military Department, I'm Airman First Class Carissa Menken.